hello how to solve for s in this equation s square minus s to the power of 3 is equal to 12 solution here we have s square minus x to the power of 3 if you take this 12 to this side it become minus 12 is equal to zero. We have s square minus s to the power of three. This minus twelve can be written as minus four minus eight is equal to zero. Then we have s square minus s to the power of 3 minus 4 can be written as minus 2 square the minus 8 can be written as minus 2 to the power of 3 is equal to 0 now let's compare this with this and pair this with this then we have s square minus this 2 square the yeah, here is minus s to the power of 3 then minus this 2 to the power of 3 is equal to 0 then this can be written as we have s square minus 2 square bracket then minus this bracket here is s to the power of 3 plus 2 to the power of 3 bracket is equal to 0 now this is in the form of perfect square that is if you have a square minus b square this is equal to a plus b bracket a minus b and here if you have a to the power of three minus b a to the power of 3 minus b to the power of 3 this is equal to if you have a to the power of 3 plus b to the power of 3 this is equal to a plus b bracket a square minus a b plus b square Then this can be written as we have s plus 2 bracket bracket s minus 2 then minus this is s plus 2 bracket s square minus 2x plus 2 square is equal to 0. Now, here s plus 2 is common. Let's bring it out. We have s plus 2 bracket. Bracket, if you divide this by this, we have s minus 2 then minus if you divide this by this we have s square minus 2 x plus 2 square that is 4 is equal to 0 now here we have 
s plus 2 bracket bracket here is s minus 2 minus s square plus 2x minus 4 is equal to 0. Then we have x plus 2 bracket bracket here is minus s square then x plus 2s this is plus 3x minus 2 minus 4 this is minus 6 is equal to 0 there are two cases here the first case is s plus 2 is equal to 0 and the second case is minus s square plus 3s minus 6 is equal to 0. Now from here, s is equal to minus 2. This is the first value of s. Also from here, we can divide all through by minus 1. Minus s square divided by minus 1. This is s square. Then plus 3s divided by minus 1. This is minus 3s. And then minus is divided by minus 1. This is plus 6 is equal to 0. And this is a quadratic equation. Let's solve this using quadratic general formula. Then our quadratic general formula is given as x is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a or s is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of d over 2a and from this equation a is equal to 1 b is equal to minus 3 c is equal to 6 Then D discriminant is equal to B square minus 4AC. Then discriminant D is equal to B square, that is minus 3 square minus 4 multiplied by A is 1 multiplied by C is 6. Then D is equal to 9 minus 4 times 1 times 6, that is 20. 4 then d is equal to 9 minus 24 that is minus 15. now let's put this back into this formula we have x is equal to minus bracket minus 3 plus or minus square root of minus 15 over 2 multiplied by 1. Now x is equal to 3 plus or minus. This square root of minus 15 can be written as square root of 15 multiplied by minus 1 over 2. Then x is equal to 3 plus or minus square root of 15 multiply by square root of minus 1 over 2 but square root of minus 1 is equal to i then x is equal to 3 plus or minus i root 15 over 2 This is also the value of x. Therefore, our final answer are s1 is equal to minus 2, then s2 is equal to 3 plus i root 15 over 2, and s3 
is equal to three minus i root fifteen over two. These are the values of s. You can see that in this solution we have one real solution and a two complex solution. So this is complex. And this is also complex. We can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong, but in order to check, we are going to make use of this real solution. To check, we have the given equation s square minus s to the power of t is equal to. 12 and when s is equal to minus 2 we have minus 2 square minus bracket minus 2 to the power of 3 must be equal to 12 then minus 2 square that is 4 minus minus 2 to the power of 3 that is minus 8 must be equal to 12 then we have 4 minus times minus, that is plus 8, must be equal to 12. 4 plus 8, this is 12, is equal to 12, which is true. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.